Ho-ho! <laughs> Mikey's asleep. Now I'm gonna get into his head and control him. I love to eat. This is a dream or reality. Mikey talks in his sleep. I'm jumping into his head. Hmm. Great! Now I've managed to get into Mikey's head. I see a lot of interesting things here. There is a computer and several laptops in the middle. They are needed to control Mikey's brain. I'm going to collect all the food that's scattered on the floor and on the walls. I hope that I will be able to take full control of Mikey's thinking now. <laughs> there will have to be a lot of redoing, but the most important thing is to turn on the levers so that he wakes up. I'll program him on laptops and make sure he regains consciousness. He's had enough sleep. He's been in a dream too long. <laughs> I sat down at the TV. I'm taking control of Mikey. What's wrong with me? I forgot to turn off Mikey's subconscious. That's it. Now he won't bother me. I would not like him to talk and interfere with me. Now I can do anything in this village and no one will stop me. Huh? It's night outside and I have to take advantage of the situation. All the villagers are asleep so I can commit various crimes in Mikey's body. The first thing I'm going to do is rob a villager's vegetable garden. But I think it won't be enough. What should I do now? I need to think about it. It seems that a very cool idea has appeared. I'm going to run into his house now. I'll see what's in his trunk and maybe figure out how to have fun. Uh oh. Now I went into the house and I see that he is asleep and does not move at all. This is very good. Now I open the chest and see that there is a brush there. Now I can paint on the walls. I think the best option right now would be to leave the evidence for the villager. That's why I'm going to draw Mikey over his bed now. Ho <laughs> ho! Hooray! Now you need to draw very carefully and avoid mistakes. It is necessary to make the drawing as similar as possible to t-shirts. I seem to be doing pretty well and all that remains is to finish the face. The drawing is ready and it's very cool. The villager will find out when he wakes up that Mikey did it. <laughs> no one will guess that I got into his head and commit such crimes. Now, I want to run all over the village and paint every house. I think it's going to be a lot of fun and I'm going to have incredible fun. I painted the sun on one house. But I definitely won't stop there because I still have a lot of plans. I have to leave as many drawings and hints as possible for the villagers. <laughs> But do not forget to take away their most valuable things. I think this is the best plan I've had in a while. Being in Mikey's body is incredibly cool. I will not miss the opportunity to draw as many drawings as possible and take away expensive materials from the villagers. <laughs> Unbelievable! I am now taking the diamonds that are on the wall of a villager. I am very surprised there are also a large number of emeralds in the chest. I'm running away from this house because I still have a lot to do. I'm going to keep drawing because I have an incredible idea. I will try to make a drawing in the form of a zombie now. Hmm. I think everyone who will pass it will be very scared and will run away. Now I'm starting to draw and I hope that I will be able to make a clear and correct drawing. I seem to be doing pretty well. I've almost finished painting Mikey's zombie look. The moment has come to see what happened to the body. It remains only to paint over part of the drawing and it will be finished. It seems to have turned out very cool and I am happy with my result. I've never done anything like this. <laughs> Mikey has become a zombie. The drawing has now become a reality. I see that the villagers are very scared because they saw the zombies and are trying to escape from me. But I will continue to control Mikey and scare them. I think it's a lot of fun and they'll never leave their homes. Every time I'm surprised that I get such a cool idea. I'm definitely not going to stop. I'm going to run after the villagers and try to scare them. Huh? They are now locked in their houses, but that's okay. I'll run on painting and leave even more clues. Now we will continue to run around the village and paint every building. I seem to be doing pretty well, so now I'm going to paint one block completely green. Now everyone will definitely hmm. think that Mikey did it. I need to keep painting on the walls. It brings me a lot of pleasure and fun. I'm definitely not going to stop. I'm going to make another drawing on another building. I seem to be doing pretty well, and I want to draw a smiley face. It's very funny. 
<laughs> oh, it seems to me that something is going on in Mikey's head right now. We need to turn off consciousness now and look. Oh no! Uh oh! There's a fire in Mikey's head right now and everything is on fire here! I don't understand what this is about. I think I see now that someone is standing at the computer looking there. I just don't understand where the fire came from. All this is somehow very strange and unusual. <gasps> I think this is a trap I've fallen into. The horror! I'm being attacked by Mikes right now. There are three of them. They're trying to destroy me, but I won't let them do it. I don't want to take control of my head. <laughs> but I can't let that happen. I'm kind of good at fighting them now. I've already destroyed everyone who is here. But we urgently need to put out the fire because Mikey's head may burn. I don't want this to happen. Therefore, now I will restore it in all possible ways and will not allow failures. Now, I'm throwing a potion all over Mikey's head in order to restore everything as it was. To be honest, I was very surprised when three of his clones appeared here and wanted to destroy me. But I fought them off and now everything will be fine. Hmm. I need to pour more potion into Mikey's brain so that he can be completely under my control. I have a lot of work to do right now because it's incredibly hard to be here. It seems to me that Mikey is already hated there and wants to be destroyed, but something completely different amuses me. Oh, <laughs> I'm sitting down at the computer now because I need to go there again. Mikey's head is fully prepared and everything should work. Great, now I can control Mikey again. Yeah. Oh. Why is my body so weird? I forgot to turn off Mikey's consciousness again. Now he said some words, but nothing terrible happened. I have not lost control, so now I will continue to run around the village. I need to collect as much food from the garden as possible because it will be useful to me. <gasps> I want to take the seeds. I've been dreaming about them for a long time. I have a strange feeling. Who's hiding in that house right now? We need to look at it urgently. The villager was trying to hide from me right now, but you won't succeed. No matter how much you run away from me, I'll catch up with you anyway. You will regret very much that you did not hide earlier. <laughs> I can see how scared he is right now and doesn't know what to do at all, but it gives me even more pleasure because I'm starting to hunt for villagers. I don't think anyone has done this. One is now burrowing into the ground and hiding there, but I see that someone else is hiding on the tower. Therefore, we urgently need to run there and try to climb up. I will scare every villager in this village and no one will be able to get away from me. I'm the Mikey that terrified this village. You know that no one can stop me. I'm evil here. It's cool. I can say these words in Mikey's head. Everyone now thinks he's the one scaring the villagers. Now a villager is trying to hide upstairs and has built a big barrier out of leaves. He's very scared and he's trying to hide from me. I never would have thought that he would climb so high. I will not be distracted by him and will continue on my way. I still have very big plans. It is very interesting what is happening in this village right now. Everyone is now locked in their homes and no one is coming out. Who do I see? A villager has just come running here and he has a phone in his hands. We need to get it for ourselves urgently. Wait, give me what you have in your hands quickly. I've been dreaming about this for a long time. I'm not going to miss the opportunity to take this phone for myself. He's trying to run away from me now and hide. <laughs> but it won't work. I see that he is weaving among the yards and doing everything possible so that I don't catch him. I have no other choice now, so I'm taking drastic measures. Don't touch me. I see that he is running home now and decided to barricade himself there. He's trying to hide very fast right now. You don't understand that I'm going to get inside his house anyway. Ho oh, ho! Give me the phone quickly and I'll use it. I want to take all the expensive things from the villagers. <gasps> oh no! Doctors are running here now. Most likely they want to catch me and tie me up so that I don't do anything. I need to run away from them urgently. They are trying to throw some kind of potion at me now. I need to hurry up, because if they catch me, I'll lose control of Mikey's body. I still don't understand how this happened. But I need to try to hide in the house anyway so that they don't get to me. These doctors cause me fear and horror. 
I do not know what to do now. They're trying to break into my house. How is this possible? Mikey's head is on fire again right now because I'm losing control of it. The doctors have disconnected the connection of the body and head with Mikey. Uh-oh. Therefore, it makes no sense for me to stay here any longer. I need to run away urgently. I put out this fire, but I'm in great danger. So, I'm choosing now as soon as possible. I have to hide before the doctors start a full examination. I don't want them to notice me. Now I've run out of Mikey's head, and I see that the doctors don't notice me. It's very good. They're trying to bring him back to consciousness. So far, nothing is working. He also continues to sleep. Hmm. I am very angry at them right now because they have deprived me of the ability to control Mikey's body. So now I'm going to grow back in size. I will solve all the problems that suddenly arose. I need to come up with a plan and try to get Mikey's body back. Now, I have already increased in size and I am very happy about it. I didn't expect that I would be able to do it so quickly. I'm going back to the doctors now and I'll try to see what they're doing with Mikey. Could you please explain to me what you are going to do with it now? We have connected a special device to it. We will continue to control the whole process. Hmm, good. I won't distract you and I'll run. I have a lot of things to do. I think I now know how to do it to take Mikey's body back to myself. I'm going to run into the police station and take the body of a policeman. The doctors will definitely not be able to refuse if I, along with other policemen, run to the house and take the body. Therefore, now we need to see what is in the police station and think everything over very well. <laughs> I hope everything goes well and I still achieve my goal. I've been watching the police station carefully now, and now I'm going to run to my house. I think I have an ingenious plan for how I can do all this. All that remains is to pick up an artifact from the chest, thanks to which I can move into other bodies and then immediately go to the police. <laughs> I have to take control of one of them as soon as possible and get Mikey's body back. Getting into the police station will be incredibly difficult, but I have to try. Now the artifact is already in my hands and I am ready to start implementing my incredible plan. I hope everything goes well and I won't be arrested. Uh-oh. I see that I definitely won't be able to get through the main entrance because there are guards there. I'll try to come in from the backyard. It remains now to behave very quietly and throw the artifact at the policeman who was standing at the counter. Once this happens, no one will know that something has changed here. Oh, it worked. Now I'm in the body of a policeman and I can do whatever I want. We need to run out urgently and in no case waste time. Colleagues, we are urgently gathering now because unknown doctors are holding Mikey's body. Now we're running away to the house where Mikey's body lies. It's time to go back there again and try to bring him back to consciousness. <laughs> I am sure that the doctors will not help so now we will detain and take the body for ourselves. We are very close to home and are now notifying the doctors. Hello, please give us Mikey's body because the police have to examine it. All right, take it. We will not argue with the police. We don't need any problems. Great, then we'll run now and do our own investigation. I am sure that we will find a lot of interesting things and we will definitely inform the doctors about it in the near future. It seems to have turned out to distract them now. They didn't realize at all that I could do such a thing in the body of a policeman. So now, I'm going to take Mikey to the bed and climb back into his head. Hmm. You just need to remember to bring the policeman's body back. I don't want him to be searched for at work and God forbid scolded for being absent from the workplace. Everything is going well for me at the moment. I am extremely glad that I managed to do all this. I have already run up to the police, go inside and leave the body of an employee. I'm here. I'm leaving the body now and running out of the police station as fast as possible. I need to get back to Mikey's body because I have to help him and bring him back to consciousness. But I do not know how he will react. So I'm going to get inside his head now and see what's going on there. <laughs> I think I'm going to see a lot of interesting things now after the doctors examined his head. 
I can't believe my eyes. There are a lot of Mikey clones running around here right now. Ugh. They're trying to destroy me. I feel so strange about you right now. My head hurts a lot and I don't understand why I slept so long. My memories are coming back to me now. JJ, how could you do this to me? Huh? Come here, I'm going to beat you very hard now and in no case will I let you get close to me again. I'll catch up with you and scold you very much for setting me up. Now the whole village hates me. Mikey is very angry right now and I need to try to get away from him. It's very dangerous, but I hope I won't get hurt after all. The good thing is that I'm small and I was able to escape in time because that way he would just trample me. Uh-oh. I need to run to my house now and try to talk to Mikey normally. Stop! I'll catch up with you anyway and I won't let you mock me anymore. You made a big joke on me and I can't forgive it. Why did you stop so abruptly now? Oh. Mikey, please forgive me. Let's bury this hatchet and let's not quarrel anymore. We've made up. That's how our incredible adventure ended. Thank you all so much for watching. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel, like it, and leave your comments.